Welcome back to the Booze Buddy Update for Friday, August 12th of 2022. An imperially angry release. Can you ranch and training whiskey? It's brought to you by Green Mountain Payments, helping local business owners save thousands of dollars by providing complimentary credit card processing equipment and zero-cost credit card processing. Visit GreenMountainPayments.com or POSN0.com today. Well, an imperially angry release is on the books, and it's a mouthful. Angry Orchard Hardcore Dark Cherry Apple Imperial Hard Cider, that is. The cidery is planning May for the fall, and other cideries are as well, but I'd much rather talk about cider releases than pumpkin spice releases, though that has already started too. But this one comes in at 8% ABV and marks the first time that Angry Orchard is releasing something that punches that high nationwide. In celebration of the ABV, it started hitting shelves on 8.8, and you can expect to see the cans on shelves near you soon if they aren't there already. They're also having a contest that I wonder if they thought it through. It's through September 8th. That's called Hardcore to the Core, and you could win $500 for your favorite hardcore activities, asterisk. Check the link for details because rules do apply. Uh, you can get details on the release, the beverage, and of course the contest at the link that is in the show notes. And can you ranch because ranch can, canning ranch water, that is. Suddenly the stuff is everywhere and new companies are planning releases of the tequila and sparkling water-based beverage. So which one do you reach for? Well, if you don't have a local one to support and you don't want to put on some hip waiters to find your way through the suddenly deep reservoir beverages, uh, not surprisingly, many of these cans are coming out of Texas, by the way. Maybe a little hard to get on the East Coast, but you can always put in a request with your bottle shop or see if they're available by mail. But instead of sorting through the sea of cans, you can click on the link to see the ones that have been sorted through for you. Link, of course, in the show notes. And training whiskey, it's the latest and potentially most ridiculous way to age rye whiskey and bourbon. Put it on a train. The gimmick seems to have run off the rails, but oddly it is picking up steam. The distillers doing this boxcar hopping app hope that Americana that's steeping out of these bottles will wake you up from the sleep car so you'll cross over all these rare well, puns to uh, pick up a bottle. Is it something that you'll be chugging along to your bottle shop for, or are you planning for another gimmick? Maybe one of the ones that's on the ocean riding a boat right now. I guess whatever you can do to stand out apart from the competition will work. You can see what's up with this one and some of the companies that are jumping on or off this platform at the link that is in the show notes. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay safe, drive sober, and support the booze that supports your local community. And I'll be back again with you on Monday.